Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we have some inspiring news to share about Kate Middleton's unwavering commitment to promoting mental health. In her second appearance during Mental Health Awareness Week, the Princess of Wales paid a visit to the Anna Freud Centre, a charity close to her heart, to engage with experts and students and discuss the latest research in mental health. Let's dive into the details. Princess Kate, who serves as the patron of the Anna Freud Center, has been an ardent supporter of the organization since the early days of her royal journey. During her visit, she participated in roundtable discussions alongside mental health experts, staff from the Anna Freud Center, and individuals who have first-hand experience with mental health challenges. The primary focus of these discussions was to explore ways to support the mental well-being of current and future generations. Among the experts present was Professor Peter Farnagy, a long-standing ally of the Princess in the field of mental health. Professor Farnagy is also a member of Kate's advisory team for the Center for Early Childhood, underscoring their collaborative efforts to address mental health issues. Following these insightful discussions, Kate spent valuable time with a group of high school students who have been actively involved in interactive activities aimed at understanding and managing their own anxious feelings. These activities align with this year's Mental Health Awareness Week theme, Anxiety. The group delved into discussions based on Let's Talk About Anxiety, an innovative animation and teacher toolkit co-created by the students themselves. This toolkit serves as a valuable resource to help students comprehend that anxiety is a normal emotion and provides practical advice on coping with it. It is an integral part of the Anna Freud Center's Closing the Gap strategy, which aims to foster new ideas and solutions in the field of mental health while addressing the unequal access to mental health support for children and young people across the arc. Unfortunately, this situation has worsened since the onset of the pandemic, as acknowledged by the Princess's office. Just a few days ago, Kate opened up about her own experiences with anxiety during the conversation with schoolgirls who were being mentored by the Dame Kelly Homes Trust. She candidly admitted that anxiety is something she feels as well, particularly when navigating royal life and facing challenges like public speaking. During the event, Kate's down-to-earth nature impressed Dame Kelly Holmes herself. Holmes shared that Kate expressed her ongoing learning journey, stating that she still has much to discover and improve upon every day. Kate's honesty humanized her and showcased her relatability. She emphasized that not everyone is perfect and that it's normal to struggle with certain aspects of life, such as public speaking. Holmes commanded Kate for her approachability, stating that she was willing to answer questions from attendees, which left a lasting impression. This interaction highlighted that someone of Kate's stature and status is human too, fostering a sense of connection and relatability. By the way, did you notice something familiar about Kate's outfit during her visit to the Anna Freud Center? That's right, the Princess of Wales previously wore the same stunning dress by Susanna London in white during a memorial service commemorating the fifth anniversary of the Grenfell Tower fire last summer. Her impeccable fashion choices always catch our attention. She paired the dress with two-tone Alessandra Rich heels, exuding elegance and style. We're curious to hear your thoughts on Kate Middleton's continued efforts to promote mental health. Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and found it informative, please consider subscribing to our channel and giving it a thumbs up. Your support means the world to us. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more updates from the British Royal Family.